What do you guys think about prejudice? It's, it's bad. I think, it's yeah. bad right? I think people right. are prejudiced because they're like it's ignorant. Information. I think they're scared about differences. I think yeah. that, um, that yeah. people tend to label other people without even getting to know them just by seeing them once or knowing a little of their background. Yeah, misinformation. And that's mm, part of prejudice. It's just yeah. stupid. I went to see this like it was kind of like an oldies concert and then like a comedy thing was after it and um i really really had to go to the bathroom and i mean the person sitting next to me was handicapped and so i felt really bad getting out and going that way because there was like a couple seats until you got to the aisle so i decided to go out the other way and these ladies were just like um, it was like a break in the thing. It wasn't like they were in the middle of a song or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And so my friend and I, we got up and we started walking out towards the aisle. And they were like, oh, man, the kids are just so, like, rude nowadays. We were walking through say how... saying, excuse me. Like, we weren't, we weren't doing anything that would make them think that we were rude. We were like, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, sorry. Like, and they were just like, oh, come on. Exactly. I was like... <sighs> The other thing about it is, I don't understand how grown-ups can walk around and they say, oh, kids are so rude these days. People don't even say, excuse me anymore. I know. They just walk by you and like, you, like hold and the then door they bump into adult. you. You hold the door for they adults, they don't even you. say thank you, and your parents teach you to hold the door open. Well, they just yeah. be Some polite. And yeah, like, there's also you. a lot of people who respect that. There are, but there's yeah. also oh, David, a lot of people who David, have, like, okay. Then Pablo, it's your turn. My aunt went to this music store and said, uh, adults only. You know, because you're thinking, oh, it might have stuff that kids can't see, you know, that kind of stuff. So my aunt went in there and, you know, it was a music store. And so she comes out and it's says, so what was wrong with it? And she says, absolutely nothing for kids. And I think this guy just didn't like kids and didn't want kids to go in there. That Jared and I, we went to Fun World and um, we went to this, um, there was this like oh, air filled yeah. thing. And then um, we were going in and then the guy goes, no, <clears throat> don't. Don't go doing flips and jumping around and doing this. He just looked at us and he, like, he doesn't know who we are. And he just says, mm -hmm. he just says. Another did thing, he say I had gone else? in before him. I had gone in before Pablo did. And he didn't say anything to me. And then he said it to Pablo. I was like, well, what about me? I'm with him. And it was really weird. I remember like a few years ago, I was at recess and someone goes, everyone, hi, the Russians are coming. And I just like, I don't even think he knew I was Russian, but I mean, it was just like out of the blue. He wanted to say it as a joke, but it really wasn't funny and it kind of offended me because, you know, it was, it's bad, yeah. especially like when you have a whole bunch of people and they don't like you because the color of your skin and they don't even know who you really are. Like they just what is it? Um, label you? Like yeah. Elisa said. They just yes. label you because yeah, like of the way you live. They would say this this kind of people, they're poor, this and yeah. this kind of people. Like, like I'm Jewish yeah. and there's like something like Jewish people are cheap. Yeah. So stuff like that. Think about it. What like makes people think that it's okay to be like making yeah. other people's lives miserable. miserable. They probably think because they're better. Yeah. Tell you the truth, I really like don't that. know. I don't know why they do it.